supporters. He took their serious arguments and argued with them. Yeah, well, I would go back to my Khaleesi analogy from Game of Thrones. Donald Trump is a conqueror in a, by mentality, not a politician. Therefore, anybody in his own tribe who is not being loyal, he's going to trash. He's going to try to make Susanna Martinez come to him. Oh, okay. He's going to try to make, he's gonna try to make Mitt Romney come to him. He's going to try to make them submit. That is his mentality. It's a mentality that's foreign to American politics. Okay, it's yeah, what yeah, he's yeah. pursuing. I have to push this a little it's further. It's what he's pursuing. Most people, when they get a job, they sort of make themselves at home. They say hello to everybody, try right. to make some friends, go to lunch with some people. This guy gets the job. He's the nominee of the Republican Party. What's he do? Who can I fight with around here? Yeah. It's an right, astounding, right. counterintuitive way, Michael, to deal with is, life. Oh, it is. And, and Why it is. is he doing it? Because what he's doing is he's bringing his style into a very staid political process, sure. which has a formality. Which you know to well. It, which I know very well. Which is the part of Donald Trump I do like, is that he does upset that apple cart. Yeah. The question now becomes, in, in the elongation of this program for the presidency, can you dial it back? And to your point, Howard, I don't think he, that's his temperament to dial it back. Yeah. It is a siege yeah. mentality. It is a submission to And he may mentality. be afraid he loses the crowd. The minute yeah. he stops being a little wild. Anyway, Michael Steele, thank you for that. As